Morning. It is Monday the 10th of July, 20 to 10. We got here a bit late today. We thought we forgot the window templates, but uh, it turns out we had them. We buried them, buried it under the bricks. <laughs> so we got here a bit later today, but we're here now. Our task today is this. So we're going up about 12 courses, just reducing this window. That's, that's it. So cutting off about here and then Obviously, like I just mentioned, we've got a template to cover that up until the windows come. And, yeah, we've, uh, as you can tell by the time lapse, we're all loaded out. Mixer's up and ready, just got to get the mix in. Um, I've got all the inside covered up, so I'll be doing the block work inside while Dad gets the brickwork done. But before all that, this needs to come out, which... Shouldn't be too bad, knock on wood. <laughs> we'll find out, but yeah, that's all there is to it, so we will catch you in a minute. Oh, and just a side note, you'll have to add this part on, Dad. This isn't all we're doing here, we've got three windows to do total, but right now, the other two need to be on scaffold. One is, actually, I can put... One is up there, and the other's round back, which we'll show you at a later time, but... So yeah, we'll be waiting on Malcolm to get the scaffolding up for that, which hopefully he does today or tomorrow. Otherwise, um, otherwise we'll be off. <laughs> I'll be off soon anyway, it's my birthday soon. You have to wish me a happy birthday on the 13th of July. <laughs> I'm saying that this video will be out in bloody September, so <laughs> it'll be come and gone. But anyway, uh, yeah, so today is this one, and then when the scaffold goes up, it'll be the other two. Which again, uh, I think one, one of them's been being reduced with a 900 lintel going in, and then another one's being bricked and blocked up again as well. I'm sure Dad will will give you this rundown again at some point. So yeah, now we'll catch you in a bit for the getting rid of the window. That probably won't show up on time because it came out so quick. A bit more dodgy workmanship. We had the rattle of edges to take the screws out, but there's no screws in it. No screws whatsoever holding it in. It was just wedged in and it wasn't even screwed to the sill. That was with a couple of taps of the rubber, rubber mallet and out it came. Which works for us, but that's yeah, not, uh... not ideal. But great for us, yeah, but not ideal if, if, when you have your windows fitted like that. <coughs> Bless you. Thank you. So yeah, we're going to pop these two saws off and I'm going to start getting into this with the uh, sawzall. And then while I'm doing that, Alex, I'm going to mix them. Mm -hmm. What we'll do is while we're here, Alex, is we'll get the upstairs prepped as well, the bathroom and the landing, yeah. like, get yeah. all this done. This looks like it may work one block. I think, well, it's two brick opening, so I think it's one block. Nice. Yeah. Cool. So let's crack on. Um, I could do pinning a sheet over the door, over the window, while I'm sawzalling so it's not blowing in. Put a couple of nails at top and at top and bottom. Yeah, let's get set up. Just got this other side plastic to take off. And the two sills. Yeah, oh yeah, the, the, what Alex, I don't know if Alex showed you not, but the uh let me show you pointing. I showed him that one, yeah. Yeah, there's a line where it's lifted and it's cracked a brick, so completely awkward spot for us because our scaffold's going over here. So we're gonna have to get that off a ladder. So yeah, we're only supposed to do in the window, but we're going to do the lintel while we're there because the lintel's completely shot. Good, uh, good idea. So yeah, let's carry on. Thank God it's not balls. Yeah. Sorry, Harvey. 
Right, so Alex has got the cheeks all exposed. There's our height, pencil line, so a little bit more to come off that side. And a touch off this side. About 20 mil. Yeah. And then Yeah, that's it. This is no way um, screw. Oh my god, that, that came out even easier. Yeah. Oh there's a nail in it. Oh, a single nail. Oh no, two. Two, but they're in the same like block, so they were never holding really. So there you go. Sorted. I think I might just take that brick out. That's a big chunk out of it. See when there's a sill over there, you don't see them. So oh. I'll, I'll whip that out while we're at it. There's a resident. You get our homes out. Yeah, so that's it, we're ready for the saws all now. So Alex is gonna nail us a sheet up there to keep the dust from blowing in the hole. And I'm gonna get these halves cut out. Twelve right. halves. I'm gonna do it my side. Hmm? I'm gonna nail it on my side. Yeah. Right, I'll get the rest of this taken out then. Well, I I'm happy. <laughs> Ready to get this cut out now, as you said, and I've just measured this, and it's 440. But it's just 450, 460, so perfectly works a block. No cutting. Just one two, three, four, four and a bit blocks. So I'm very happy with that. <laughs> I'll get you set up for Dad to um, whack out these halves with the saws all, and I'll get the mix on like Dad said. So I'll catch you in a bit, see you up here. Okay, 11.08, I think we've pulled back that hour we've lost this morning, easy, that thing, doing the business again, I'd say 20 minutes tops there to get 12 halves out, Let's see how I eat, I've nicely cut straight through them, and just pop them out, and you cut the top, so it leaves a little bit of mortar in, so it's all sealed up, so now it should be just two bricks, three, two, three, all the way up to here. Then once that's in, I can get the timber frame inserted and a couple of screws into that, so that's um, temporarily fixed till Robbie comes back and gets the windows fitted. So that's my job now. Alex just nip the toilet, so I'm gonna do that now. Start the brickwork till he gets here. Once he gets here, he can jump on the work. And then I'm gonna go off to Berries and get some insulation, some uh, 50 mil. That's the plan, I forgot I've got to take this brick out here. <coughs> it's a bit scabby, I don't want to leave that in. There are chips in the house, in the bricks, but not many, so that would stand out like a sore thumb. So I'll just whip that one out and I'll get me more to set up and get cracking.
quick update. Obviously, nicely working one block, but um, of course, so we thought we'd left the template, we hadn't, so we went back home, realised we had our template, but we completely forgot that we still needed insulation. <laughs> but thankfully, because we're in Leyland, we can, uh, Dad's just gone, Dad's just nipped to berries, so he's going to grab some insulation now. Because I think we need some for some lintel jobs coming up anyway. So, not a massive loss, just a bit annoying that we wound up forgetting a bit of bloody insulation. But yeah, this is looking nice so far. I've got my screw ties in, and I've got a. Uh, because it. Mm, I'm thinking because it's 72, 73s. No, it's alright. We can put the tie wires in accordingly. I was going to put them in now, but we've already got a set in. So we've got our tie wires in, got our screw ties in. In fact, you know what? Screw tie, tie wire. There's the second one. We're on to you lot. <laughs> yeah. So, I'll get another set of screw ties in on this course and then we'll get the last of the tie wires in probably on the next course on this course so progress I'll get you set up while I start block cleaning until get dad gets back Done. I wish all window patch ups were that easy, bloody hell. There you go, four blocks and a course of brick is what topped it off. So I'll just uh, show you on this side. Point it up on this side as well, Mr. Spot. There we go. That's both sides pointed up, so plenty of mortar packed in there. Tie wires, two, four, six, six. There you go, and look who's arrived, just in time. What time is it? Let me check my watch. Twelve oh six. We have a bit of lunch. We'll see what Dad says, but that's my part done. So once Dad's got this brickwork in. I think, well I think now that I'm done, I think I'm going to make a start, making a mess upstairs, I think. Get start, get, make a start at least ready for the brick and block work when we get onto this job eventually. Next, when we get onto the next part of this job eventually.
Right, we had a bit of a long dinner. It had been raining. And there you go, Alex's little brick up there. That's the only frame that's going in any minute. I'm going to do that. Alex is just stripping off, not literally, stripping the plaster off ready for a bricking up. I will send you up to him so he can explain what's going on and then he can send you back. Ready? So I'll send it to Alex. So, I'm knocking all this bit out, uh, only this side because the window's being blocked up to here. That's going to still be a window. This is going to be blocked and bricked off just for make it easier to use and not have to faff around. So. And then when the scaffold gets done, we're going to put a new lintel outside because it's napped. Yeah, well you can see a, a bit here that it's definitely rusted. Nice timber one here, so that one's fine. Uh, just going to take this out a little bit more, I reckon, and then doing the same in the bathroom. Customers thankfully just uh, got rid of all the stuff in there, so I can make a mess. Yeah, just show what we're doing. The back we're building in from the right hand side. So we're building in from this side up to somewhere about here, I think. There you go, that's uh, that plan of action. Here's Dad. Butterfingers. Good job to it's on carpet, isn't it? <laughs> that was a lousy throw. Anyway, yeah, that's good. I'm going to whack that in a sec. Yeah. Like I say, Robbie's built all the dubby frames for us to, so we can come build them in and then he, leave it secure and then he can come after. And then um, the windows are going to fit straight in then. And we're not like building the building the open like I say that's straightforward enough but here we'll be uh, fixing the dummy frame in before we build it and actually sorry about the wind we'll be putting the dummy frame in and actually building up to it which makes it quicker and easier for us and um, and then the the opening can't be wrong for Robbie then because it, that's where he's measured his windows to his dummy frame so this is just for security this one so I'm gonna get this in and then um, get it fixed in with a couple of grabbers and then go and help Alex upstairs. We want to get this done as quick as possible because um, the uh, uh, the customer's mum is like elderly so we want to get the stairs uncovered as quick as possible because it's a bit dodgy having um, even for, for young people to walk upstairs with a really dust sheet on it. So yeah, that's the plan. Alex is nearly done up there so we can start tidying up down the stairs and then get into the bathroom and I'll get this bit um, fixed in and tidied up. So yeah, I'll just put it in time lapse. Yeah. What's happening with these tiles? Are they getting put back on at all? Pardon? Are they getting put back on? Yeah, just take them off as neat as you can, you know, up to the edge. Leave the, leave the, them ones off. Just take the underside ones and try and leave the edging on if you can, so in case they can be repaired. But what? It should be an edging around the corner. Try and leave that on. Just take the inside, the underside ones off if you can. You might not be able to.
Time lapse, I'm stacking two, but you probably saw the first two in the video. Those bricks are tough, brilliant. So these would be straight in, but these original house bricks are so hard, extra, extra tough. Them I should really, with it being temporary, should just gone into the beds, but they don't really work well into the beds. The grabbers, but like I say, it's temporary. Just stick some insulation in there. There's a little gap at the top, so that's just stop any drafts. That's secure now. Alex is done with the landing, he's actually in the bathroom now, so I'll take you up there. There we go. That's one one window done. Pretty pretty nice brick match that as well. Not too bad considering the other options were very orange or slightly orange. <laughs> yeah, not bad. And then I'll take you inside quick so you can see see the rest. There's my side. And then up here, now that everything's clean, here's all this part knocked out for this window, and here's all this knocked out for that window. The break was already there, just want to let you know that. I didn't, I didn't break that window. The crack got a bit bigger, but it was already cracked to begin with. <laughs> so then that up to here, there we go. So I'll take you back out. And that is us for today. So we'll be back here tomorrow, hopefully. Is Malcolm got back to you? I'm not sure today. I haven't gone over the stuff here in the van. Or if the, and if the rain didn't keep us in the air van. So we'll be back here hopefully tomorrow. We'll be doing some block playing.